Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and this is Iris Stories and yung kaistorya for today. And if you're bagong my channel, please don't forget to like, share and subscribe. And please don't forget to click the notification bell below para updated ka sa mga videos. So for today's video, I am going to unbox my Baxter brand BP apparatus. So let's go. So ayun na nga po guys, no samahan niyo ako ng i-unbox ng aking Baxter brand BP apparatus which are the aneroid spigmo manometer and the stethoscope so let's start so it's stethoscope muna tayo Assemble. So, na-assemble na natin ang stethoscope. So, ito po yung flat diaphragm, bell-shaped diaphragm, the tube, this one is the air tube, the ear tips, and this one is the binaural spring, and this, there is also a name tag here. So, that's the part of the stethoscope. Next, let's unbox the spegmo manometer. So, mag-assemble muna tayo. Actually, connected na siya. Yung manometer niya, connected na siya dito sa cup. Unlike sa iba, detachable po siya. Pero dito, connected na po siya. Much better para hindi na hassle ilagay-lagay yung manometer. dapat ma-push natin siya ng maayos kasi pag mag-inflate tayo mamaya 
dito dadaan yung ear so ayan assemble na natin yung sping manometer so these are the parts so first we have the pressure cuff pressure cuff ito and this is the aneroid manometer gauge aneroid manometer gauge and this one is the uh, tube connectors tube connectors yeah, ito yung tube connectors ito naman po isang ano um air release valve and this one is the inflation bulb. So, ayun po yung parts ng pang BP natin. Mabilis lang siyang i-assemble, diba? So, pwede ko na agad itry yung sarili ko, no? Paano malalaman yung BP natin? So it's um, systolic over diastolic. I try myself. So yung first na tuto dog, yun po yung pinaka uh, systolic natin. Then yung last na pulse na tuto dog is yun po yung ating diastolic. That's how to get a BP. Try ko lang yung sarili ko. So, syempre, kung ilalagay natin ito sa ear natin, it should be face papunta doon pag ilagay natin dito. Oh my god, I have the headset. So, para marinig natin yung pulse ng ating brachial, we have to open in this part. Actually, push mo lang siya, tapos ikot, open. May makikita kang silver. Tapos, kung i-close mo siya, ikot mo lang ulit. So, ayan, close po yan. Actually, sa personal may kita niyo, pag silver na po yung makita niyo, ibig sabihin, open na po siya. So, i-close ko muna. Lipikin sarili ko. Ito, ito. Sariling sikap, no? makapag-BP lang. So, ito yung valve natin at saka yung air releasing valve. Kailangan nakalock po itong air releasing para ma-inflate po yung ano natin, cough. Okay? So, open na siya. Yung dito natin, open na. Yung sa bell shape, diaphragm. So, kailangan tatakpan to para marinig natin yung pulse sa brachial part natin. Let's go. I hope pakuha ko yung BP ko. Wow. Normal naman yung BP ko. It's 110 over 70. Puyat pa yan ha. Ah. 
Actually, masyadong malakas siya. Nakakadini talaga siya. So, I am 110 over 70. So, yun lang guys. Uh, para malaman natin yung BP natin. Uh, you have to get first the MIP which is dito po ko yung kinukuhang po sa radial natin. And then, ang BP naman, dito po yung sa brachial natin. So, yung unang tutunog, pag-release mo. So, ito kasi yung ano natin, air releasing bulb. Pag i-release mo tong air, unti-unti siyang iikot. Yung unang tumunog, yung po yung systolic natin, or yung nasa upper. And the last na tumunog, yun naman po yung diastolic natin. Yun naman po yung lower. So, ang systolic ko is 110, and the diastolic ko is 70. So, 110 over 70 yung BP ko.